Easy riding conditions. On the extreme right, Duck and Dumplings, one of the two runners in blue headgear, they're about to come in and they're away and whipping round at the start, Herodian Flyer has tailed off and can hardly win from there. Duck and Dumplings with Pearl Noir blasting down the centre of the course. Pearl Noir and Charlotte Hogg probably the overall leader. Duck and Dumplings on the near side, the two Scott Dixon train runners dominating. Chased by Cape of Storms in a pink jacket and then not too far away is Foresight as they head on towards the final three furlongs, they're well and truly strung out. And towards the stand side, Pick and Sort is also not too far away. And they're followed by the winning lines. And uh, Gideon Up is also in about fourth or fifth place now towards the centre. And on the far side, trying to run on, is a Brit of All Right. But it's still Pearl Noir getting a bit tired, perhaps. Here's Duck and Dumplings with a renewed effort on the near side. Followed by Gideon Up and the winning lines under Ali Vance trying to get on terms as they run now towards the final half furlong. And it's Duck and Dumplings that leads by the winning lines in second place Duck and Dumplings and Dido Harding pulling away close to the finish and Duck and Dumplings wins the Magnolia Cup by about four or five lengths two in second the winning lines uh, for third possibly Pearl Noir though running on on the far side of Brit of All Right and Camilla Swift and behind those Gideon Up in the pink jacket